the world of David Jones. From old fashion. Ladies and gentlemen, on piano, Miss Lauren Hutton. Thank you. There's no other bell like Tino. And there's no other store like David Jones. Come on, sing it with me. Okay, do it. And there's no other store like David Jones. To French high fashion. Presenting David Jones, the name of fashion. David Jones was founded in 1838 by David Jones. It is the oldest store with its original name. David Jones is owned since 2014 by South African retail group called Woolworths. Woolworths has slipped into the red flag for the financial year due to a 6.9 billion impairment of David Jones. It offers wide range of clothing. beauty and home making products if um, if your product's not right your offers not right your values are not right um, if you haven't invested in in online um, uh, then sure um, you you're going to be a dying retailer um, but that's nothing to do with being a department store. There are very successful department stores around the world. Um, the CEO of Woolworths discusses differentiating to sell exclusive brands, right, um, private label versus um, brand mix, um, and investing in the future. Um, and that's, that's what we have to do. You know, we've invested in online, we've invested in systems, we've invested in stores. Um, we've got great relationships with the best international and local Australian um, brands. And as we've been through this enormous transformation that really has been incredibly disruptive and costly. David Jones said ambitious target for every product to be ethically sourced. Let's build a smarter planet and the sustainability initiative began like reuse of the natural resources to reduce the impact on the environment and empowering the women to break the black cycle of trauma. And it was given an F rating for weak and the non-existing policies and 32% of the David Jones collection is now sustainable. To increase their sales and profit, David Jones is seeing changing their brand ambassadors and CEOs time and again. One of the names that got most popular was Adam Goods, a former Australian of the year and two times Brownlow medalist. To survive 175 years in retail, you need to be able to adapt. We realised that our competitors were changing. Food strategy worth 100 million that started from Bondi of Sydney to Melbourne was another initiative of David Jones to attract young customers in their shop. Online shopping was another move to make the work better. 